By the end of this video, you will know how to make a basic A-line skirt pattern from start to finish in clothes. You can apply this pattern drafting method onto hand drafting pattern as well as onto cloth drafting. For example, I'm going to use cloth software to draft these skirt patterns. You will not require to know cloth software to learn this simple drafting method. I will walk you through step by step on how to draft these A-line skirt patterns. These include measuring your body, picking the correct avatar size for your skirt, sewing it in clothes, fitting the skirt onto the avatar, then apply the fabrics onto the skirt all done in clothes. After that, I'm going to show you how to mark the waist circumference as well as the hip circumference. To do so, I'm going to this, once again, the second tool icon from the top, click on it. Then hover the mouse to the right and this time, instead of select edit pattern tool, I'm going to select add point slash split line. And I'm going to come back to this page over here and I'm going to hover my mouse over on this edge top fabric line and then right click. And as you can see, the yellow line is the line length from the right and the blue line is the line length from the left. We want to add the value into the blue line, which is the value from the left, okay? So the value for the skirt waist circumference is 23. And I'm going to leave everything as is and click OK. Next, I'm going to mark the hip circumference. Once again, while this add point slash split line is active, I'm going to hover the mouse over that line and then right click. And I'm going to put the value in this line too, the blue color one, okay? So the hip circumference in this case is 26.5. After that, leave everything as is, just click OK. Okay, so as you can see, we just create the internal lines for the waist curve, as well as for the hip line and for the hem curve line. And we also marked both the waist circumference as well as the hip circumference. Next, I'm going to show you how to use the internal line to connect from one point to the neck to form a skirt block, okay? So to do that, I'm going to come over here to this internal line tool, click on one, and then hover the mouse to the right, and then select internal polygon slash line. After that, I'm going to begin the point from this low waist line point, and then connect to this high waist line point, And then I'm going to come over here to this hem curve this top hem curl line and then I'm going to come over here to this base skirt line, click on it and then right here I just hover the mouse over up backward to where I was starting and now I'm going to just click one more time on that point to finish the internal line. Next, I'm going to show you how to create the curve for our internal line. To do so, I'm going to come over here to the second tool icon here, click on it and hover the mouse to the right and select Edit Curvature, okay? This point, I'm going to press down Option All and left click on the workspace and drag it down. I want to pan it down a little bit and to the right. Now I'm going to zoom in. To zoom in, once again, I'm going to just slide both of my finger forward on the mouse pad on my laptop to zoom in, okay? Next, I'm going to click one on the page 
to release this highlight it's kind of hard to see just click one on the page to release next i'm going to click on this waist curve and to curve this waist curve okay just slightly curved guys it doesn't have to be a lot just a little bit of curve and i'm going to do the same thing here so i'm going to click so while this curvature tool is active i'm going to just click and then kind of slide to the right to create a curve i'm going to do the same with the hem curve but instead of click and drag to the right i'm going to click and drag downward right there okay as you can see we just formed this internal line for an a line skirt block i'm going once again click one on a page to release okay Now I'm going to create a skirt dot for the skirt. To create a skirt dot, I'm going to come over here to the second tool icon from the top, click on one and then hover the mouse to the right, click on edit pattern tool and come over here, click on this dot internal line and then I'm going to right click and select extend slash trim and add point okay then hover the mouse to the right and then select two pattern outline okay after that i'm going to click once again on the internal line and i'm going to right click and this time i'm going to select convert to baseline okay so while the edit pattern tool is active i'm going to click on this you see this right there that point that we created earlier click on it and then right click then i'm going to select add dot and this dot window pop up i'm going to type in the total of the dot three and i'm going to type in the dot length 12. after that i'm going to click on ok and i'm going to press down return and enter on the keyboard to confirm so we just create the perfect dot for an A-line skirt.